What did you do as a new player? When you're new to the game, you do some silly things that you grow out of. So here are 10 things that I did when I was new, and I'm curious if you did them too. Number one, horrible staircases. We would go mining and we would have these horrible short staircases and you'd bump your head every time. Do you remember doing this? I remember doing this and I thought it was okay. It, this was normal. It was, this is as fast as you could get up and down your staircase. There's no need to add extra room. And the scary thing is there's people that still do it and they're not new to the game. Like wh wh why? Number two, lava lighting. Do you guys remember doing this? We would uh, put this in our houses and it was just really cool to have something that's usually so dangerous and kind of hard to find, at least back then, uh, in your house as lighting. If, as long as you had no wood around, you were fine. Or if you're on a server that allowed you to not have fire tick. It's just, so, oh, it's some, yeah, it's just so cool to have something so dangerous, be kind of harmless. Number three, nerd poles. So I only really remember these from back in alpha when on servers, you couldn't die. So you could just build these anywhere to the maximum build height and jump down and you were fine. And everyone just used them to look around, like to see the terrain around them because you know the render distance wasn't great then and you'd be looking for a nice place to build. Number four, I blame servers for this, but it is, uh, trying to pick up spawners. If you're not playing on a server, you can't do it. And uh, you just, yeah, you, you get nothing. That's that's really all. Maybe we did do it before servers did it, but yeah, it, it was sad to realize that you can't pick up an item. I hate asking, but if you find the video entertaining, consider subscribing. Anyway, let's get back to it. Number five, repairing. Repairing can kind of be useful, but with mending, there's no real need for it. So it, does that make mending overpowered? Either way, uh, yeah, when you're a new player, oftentimes you might think it's really advantageous to go mining and then you'll get some extra diamonds and you'll probably be in a profit and you can repair your whole pickaxe with four diamonds, essentially. The problem is you can use a fully made pickaxe and do it anyway. Now, if this had enchantments, this would make sense, but this obviously doesn't because why not just use this pickaxe? But the point is we're saving a single diamond. So that's a big mistake new players make as well as just not getting mending. They think it's a lot harder. I guess because villages are kind of hard to understand when you're new to the game. Either way, next one. Number six, underground tree farms, or at least especially underground farms in general. Do you guys remember building this? It's kind of silly. Like, why did we do this? It, it took so much effort but here's the thing i think it, it's just cool to be able to like control you know where things grow it's like to have that power of like i can grow trees underground i just need a torch and i think it's also like it's safer back in the day i think this is more of an old school kind of thing like back in the beta oh one just grew <laughs> they're actually quite slow to build uh, grow down here anyway yeah, uh, I think that's the main reason. It was just cool and old school. I don't know if anyone, any new players like today would do this, but it's just cool. Number seven, walls and compounds. Do you, did you guys ever do this? Because I did. My first goal of making a new world was pretty much to make a compound like this so it'd be really safe. I'd build a small set of walls like this after mining for a little while, and I would set up my main area, you know, my storage and all that and I'd slowly expand it. I'd need trees so I wanted to make room in that. It just felt safer. I was scared to go out the outside. Out there was creepers and skeletons and all that and I was just scared of it all. So yeah, did you guys ever do that? Number eight, trying to break bedrock. That's about it. Number nine, mine shafts. Did you guys ever do this? Because I did. Just a huge hole, you dug it out and you made a staircase and this was your mine. This was how you mined. You tried to keep it as neat as possible and all the layers as they were. But yeah, this is what I did. I, I was, always liked the idea of just being able to have this and you could see it was if it was daytime when you're at the bottom or if it was raining. It was very tedious to climb though and not to mention you could fall off. But yeah, I'm curious. Did other people do this as well? Number 10. It's, well, I think you get it. 
It's blowing stuff up just for fun. Villagers are an easy target. And let's be honest, it's not really a newbie thing because we all still do it. Because it's just, who, who can not find this satisfying? The destruction. I'm a little sad we didn't get all the way down to some stone. Oh, yes, we did over here. Let's go do that again. I found a new village. Let's do it. I'm a bit worried it won't end. <laughs> Look at all the sand. <laughs> uh, I think we're coming to the end, are we? Uh, no, not at all. Oh, we're at the end. Uh, it's raining sand. That was much better. Well, that's it for the video. I will see you guys in the next one. Thank you for watching. Ciao. I honestly expected to die. I don't know what to do with myself now.